A snowstorm in the US spreading from New York to South Carolina has dumped up to two feet of snow and has affected 85 million people. At least 19 people have died, mostly from traffic accidents, but some caused by hypothermia. In Washington, residents are having to constantly battle with the falling snow to clear paths and roads. We just cleaned and it's already covered back in snow again, so I'm just trying to keep up with the snow. It got heavier as the last hour went on. Some locals have organised their own snow clearing groups, taking matters and shovels into their own hands. Personally, like I want to keep it you know, and our neighbours are the same way. We want to keep it walkable for people if they have to be out for whatever reason. Back in the city, tourists embraced the cold front to experience the White House at its very whitest. It's just kind of an experience you don't get to have from where I'm from. So, you know, it could be sitting inside, you know, keeping warm, but it's a once in a lifetime kind of thing. So why not take advantage of it? But as the full force of snowstorm Jonas rolled in, the message was clear. Head home, stay indoors and don't try to travel unless you really have to.